Access to the back line if they see them coming. They also have to look for Haunter. He pushes in on Golden Blue. Tries to give him the defense immediately. Rainover picks up Elder Dragon for the team. Damage now on the Haunter in the back. It's Fenskeren going down now. Piglet has fallen. The AD damage is gone. And they've got the Dragon just as GSM got the Baron before. It's kind of one to the other, and they have to get they back to go, their They gotta base. go, they gotta go. They're gonna yes. try to end the game here so quickly. They're gonna try to actually stop the Haunts. They're gonna try to stop the backs and chase them down. They have to walk all the way up here. He's gonna find Golden Clue. They are playing stop the back game. Now on to the Nexus turrets. Ground Warp has been the key for TSM this game. They're, to They're on the Nexus turret. Turtle's gonna be on this one. It's not even a chance. So walk the, back. the way they can oh defend is if they can secure this Baron, because that buys them more time. Oh. Oh, it's Smithy, the time buyer of all time buyers. Can he do it? He's in there. This might buy 50 50. He steals it. And Counter Logic Gaming is very much still in it. Maybe on the path of victory with a follow up fight. Right over solo. There's a Rodo flying in. Doshan TP'd, but he wasn't actually able to get Baron. He's out of the Nexus. Does it even matter that Smithy just came up that big? Yes, it does. What a barn burner. Darshan, a few more hits, he gets it to go down. 42 minutes on the clock. Counter Logic Gaming defeats Immortals. Gonna go for it, and they do. Vitos is gonna look for the Nexus turrets here, though. If they can get enough damage, he's gonna find the sun. High gets the Kales, though. Shifter finds not enough damage taken and went down. And Coast have to run away. Midas will close the game out by himself. Oh, he's looking to. Balls is on the hunt. He's trying to keep vision. He's denying the backs. He's gonna get away from this one. Daydream is gonna get a recall in the brush. Zyus Bart about to get found by Balls, but can shift their first amount. They're gonna look for the damage, gonna get rid of for Nexus, but in hip. Nexus turret number one is gone. Nexus turret number two. Oh, oh it's it's well, shift the first away. Medios trying to close the game by himself, putting Cloud9 on his back. And the 4-4-2 Medios takes down 
the Nexus. Well, wow. Well, that's a way to win a game. And yeah, last one of your season, or just split at the very least. Bob's going for the win while the fight is happening here. Jin Air distracted. Will the fight even matter? If Smithy comes back in, they're actually going to win the fight as well. And Darshan stopped by Wing. He's going to get the Nexus turrets anyway. Recalls coming in from Jin Air. Can Darshan do it? He's chopping away at the Nexus. Half health. Oh, they stop him. Oh, Darshan cleanses away. Can he get it? Oh, he got it. Got the Nexus CLG takes game one. Oh man! Sense. Yep, that's right. Ray zoning him out. They get the position onto the dragon. Dragon came up. There's a teleport oh, for Sunday. He's cute. gonna try for the back door. Actually, that was Nogne that teleported in. They grabbed Gorilla. Is there going to be a fight? Big knockup. Someday trying to get the back lines. Gets exhausted. They will take him out. Nogne going towards the Nexus right Sunday. now, though. Oh, Smep goes back. He finds Nogne. There's the Zonius, but it doesn't matter. Nogne cannot. Oh, Zonius from Smep. Who's going to win it? Nogne comes back in. He gets the kill. And now the base vulnerable for two Tigers. Can Nogne end it? Right now, they tried to recall. Recall from Gorilla was successful. Can he stop Nogne? I don't know. Home Rise is his head much away. There's the other ability to use Gorilla trying to stop him. Can he do it? Nogne hacking away at the Nexus. A grab on the Prey mixes. Nogne still so low. He's got that shield. The Nexus, he gets it. KT ties it up. What a backdoor. What, what a game from KT. Meanwhile, you can see the SK Gaming are just keeping them delayed. They've got two inhibitors down, and they are just going to pile straight up towards those super minions in the base. You can see there's coming in there. Peke is definitely on towards the Nexus. Kevin is going to be able to go into it. He's trying to do it, but meanwhile, they're in the base. Yellow Star's trying to defend them in the base. Peke is trying to take the Nexus down. Is anyone going to be able to deal with this one? Catches him with another X. He's very low on that. Running back and forth. Dyrus has the map. That Superman isn't going down. Nexus turret. Oh my gosh! As soon as the minion dies, he's gonna lose some damage. But I think he's got it. He's got it crushed on this next hit. That's one Nexus turret down. This is pretty much written in Dyrus with the team. Dyrus gets hit up. This might be the time. Now he starts to teleport. He goes in. Dyrus is going to have to get out with the team. He leaves the slicing maelstrom on. Crumbs goes for the speed up on the ultimate. Dyrus really might be jump in. That's gonna they get stop. locked on they an inhibitor. The amazing gets hit. Kiwi Kid's a little too far here. He's gonna have to try and get himself out. Living artillery and the rest of the shots of fire. Zion right. is just they killing the next out. Zion Spark could easily single-handedly win the game by himself. 54-54 on the clock. The Nexus turret. He has minions. It's gonna be on to the next. Amazing, kind of amazing. He misses the shockwave, or the sonic wave, I should say. And he hits the Tempest. The cripple may slow the attack, but it's not on that anymore. Oh my god. He's gonna be able to hit it. A few last hits. Oh, oh my god, he wins the 